So this is uh, the map, more or less, <laughs> uh, of Italy, also called uh, Bel Paese, beautiful country. So I'd like to tell you that the, the shape of the, the map is really similar to a boot. If you see, it is the here. Yeah. So Italy is the land of wine. Uh, in fact, every Italian region has a different types of wine because there are more than 350 varieties of grapes. Why in Italy the uh, wine is so popular? Firstly, because Italy is also called, like I, I said, I told before, the green country, full of fields and farming, where it's possible to grow a lot of different fruits and vegetables. Secondly, because uh, uh, wine for it Italian people is like art, not a bizarre. The north is really completely different from the south, because, uh, um, like we can say, is a narrow, long stretch of land surrounded by sea. The rules uh, also uh, applies to wine, which manifests peculiarity rarely available in, a, in any other part of the world. If you want to discover more, of course, I suggest you traveling to Italy. Uh, in any Italian city, you can admire the historical monuments, then you can also uh, enjoy a lunch with local food and wines. There is not a region in Italy that doesn't offer culinary pearls. That will surprise you. An, an aspect of Italy that uh, impresses tourists is the climate, often mild and pleasant. Italian sunny days are perfect, both for a busy city or of art, or for enjoying the beautiful seaside. Anyway, what about wine? So, um, Italy is the country with the highest number of native wines, more than 500. Uh, not other country in the world can boost of a similar variety, variety that gives birth to an endless range of wine. The climate and the various of, uh, of, the, of the fields of the 20 Italian region are the basis of the difference between Italian wines. We have four categories, sparkling, that always uh, is uh, called uh, prosecco or spumante, red, white and rosé. The name of the wine is always linked to the place of region of, uh, or for the grape uh, uh, varieties uh, of the plus region. For example, if we have uh, uh, Moscato d'Asti. Okay. Asti is the place where the wine is produced, and Moscato is the uh, Italian name for uh, Mosca, that is the variety of grapes. So, always the, the name of the wine is linked or with the place or region or with the grapes, variety of grapes. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you want to ask me if does uh, the best Italian wine exist, the answer is no, because uh, I don't take the, this kind of responsibility uh, of choosing the best Italian wine, but uh, because of, of course every person has a different taste uh, and preferences about wine. One of the most famous uh, red wine is called Barolo. Okay. Is really really good. Is a is a, is a red wine. is produced in the north of Italy, but is also really expensive. One bottle can be cost 100 150 euros. So it's really really expensive. Yeah. And uh, the other famous um, wines are Barbera d'Asti or okay or Dolcetto d'Alba. Okay. They are both produced uh, in uh, Trentino. Trentino is a region in the north of Italy. But my, uh, my three favorite wines, red wines, because I love red wines, are the first one is Sagrantino di Montefalco. Okay, it's red. And this kind of wine is produced in the middle, in, the, in a region called Umbria. I'm really attracted to this region because my father was born in this region and I have also a cottage in, uh, in this region and I always I spend my holiday there. And uh, the other, my favorite wine are, uh, so it's Primitivo, from the south, Puglia, uh, I think it's her, so it's Puglia, I don't know. Maybe it's her. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and uh, also, uh, which one? Okay, the, the last one is Chianti. Okay. 
okay? Also, was, is produced in the middle of Italy from Tus Tuscany, and always the, the tourists eat the, the stick with the Chianti, it's the perfect, the name of the stick is Fiorentina, it's really famous. But what about Italian wine? The most famous are, so white, this is red, this is white. Okay, so, uh, I, I wrote, I am writing for only a few names because, uh, like I, I told before, there are 500 of types of wine. So it's really I I write my some of my favorite maybe yeah. Uh, okay, Nicola. So Pinot Grigio and Sauvignon they are produced in the north. Trentino is the, the name of the region, and also Ribolla is really really good and it's produced in the. Um, also in the north, yeah. For the sparkling water, I can I oh, I can I forgot the sparkling water because uh, the prosecco is a uh, I think it's the most famous wine, Italian wine. And always the Italian people drink a glass of prosecco for a special occasion like a birthday party or Christmas. Or for example, uh, at midnight during the New Year's Eve, we open a bottle of prosecco for a. Uh, um, wish us a happy new year. So I just uh, to say to told her enjoy your glass of Italian wine and have a nice drink. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.